Hi everyone. Welcome to our new video. In today's video, we will guide you on how to set up UAE VAT features in QuickBooks Online and also covering how to record sales, purchases, and expenses and how to generate VAT report in QuickBooks Online. If you never used QuickBooks before, this is the video for you. And at the same time, watch this video to get updated on VAT features because QuickBooks Online has changed a bit from its previous versions. But before you move ahead, please hit that subscribe button to make sure you're kept up to date with all of our VAT related videos. For setting up the VAT, first, go to the tax tab. In the left hand panel, you can see the tab for taxes. Click that. And we will click set up VAT. Here, we will fill up the VAT related informations. All these informations are available in your tax registration certificate. Get the TRN certificate first before we start filling this form. Here we have to enter the starting month. Next, fill the filing frequency. In our case, it's quarterly. So select that. Select reporting method accrual and enter the tax registration number as per your tax registration certificate. Once everything is done, click next and Click OK. VAT feature has enabled in QuickBooks Online and you are ready to record and track VAT. Let's make sales and purchase entries with VAT. First we will record a sales entry. To record sales, click on New Invoice. Select the customer. Select date. Here, we will select the VAT. The VAT can be either inclusive or exclusive. Here we will record VAT exclusive. Save the transaction. Let's record another invoice with VAT inclusive. Create a new customer. Now here, we will select inclusive of tax. You can see, the total amount is inclusive of VAT. Save the transaction. Let's create a sales, with zero rate. Create the customer. Select currency. Here, we will select zero rated as it's an export. Save the transaction. Now let's create a bill entry with VAT. Click on New. Select Bill. Create Supplier Name. Here we will create 
Abu Dhabi Distribution Company, as the supplier. Select Category, under Utilities, as it is Water and Electricity Charges. Or, you can create another ledger name as, Water and Electricity Charges. Type the taxable value, as per the supplier invoice. Select Tax. Cross-check taxable and tax values, with the supplier invoice, and save it. Let's create an Expenses Entry, with VAT. Click New. Click Expenses. Create Supplier Name, or select the supplier, if already created. Payment Account here is Cash. Select the Payment Date. Select the Payment Method as Cash. Type the taxable value. Select Tax. And save the transaction. Now let's see, how to generate the VAT report, as per the transactions that we recorded. Click on Taxes. Here you can see, total VAT collected on sales, total VAT paid on purchases, and VAT payable for the period. To generate the VAT return, click Prepare VAT Return. As per this report, you can simply fill the figures in the FTA portal. Click here, if all transactions are correct. But before that, change the filing date, and select the exact filing date. Hope this video is helpful to you. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, so you don't miss out on our new videos. Thanks for watching.